February favourites. Well, February went really quick for me. I had a lot on in February and just blink and it's done and it's gone. Okay, let's start with the good stuff, the makeup. So first up I'm going to talk about a eyeliner. Now this eyeliner I knew about, um, didn't really want to buy it because I bought a different colour of it and hated it. <laughs> But I saw Carrie from 615 Care Bear using it and I thought, wow, that goes on really nice and really black, so I'll have to try it. So it is the Maybelline Gel Eyeliner and this is in Blackest Black. Now I have the uh, aubergine colour and it's really dry and not pigmented at all. And I thought the black would probably be the same so I didn't buy it. But then Carrie used it and it looks so good and it went on so nice and so black and really matte as well which I really like in an eyeliner and oh I've just been loving this eyeliner this month. Uh, next we have a lipstick and it's the one I'm wearing so this is the uh, NYX lipstick in Thalia which is a really beautiful mauve that is quite um, purple based. Uh, let me just see. Uh, let's hope I didn't get that everywhere. It's a great everyday lipstick and um, I can't believe I didn't know about it until now because I absolutely love it. A makeup brush that I've been really, really, really loving uh, ever since January has been my Haku Hodi brush. Now I only have one because they're so flippin' expensive. Now this one is H2901. That is the name of this brush if you're curious. It is quite similar to my all-time favourite 231 um, Lux Petite Crease Brush from Zoeva. They both have that same kind of shape. The Zoeva brush is a little bit fatter, I would say, and not as soft um, and a bit more dense. But as you know, this one I love just running the color underneath my eye and blending it out really quickly, all in one step. Well, this one does the same job. I don't know why I didn't think of using this one for that because I've had this since IMATS 2013 and I really have only just started using it. I know, silly, really stupid, uh, but it is a great brush. Now, I don't know if I'm cheating, but <laughs> I uh, have wanted to buy this next product ever since it came out in Australia, I think back in October, September. And um, they've been constantly sold out. So, the product that I am talking about is the Josie Moran Coconut Watercolor Eyeshadow in Playa del Pink, which is a stunning pink champagne shade. And I have it all over my lids today. It is so reflective and so metallic. The pink is just stunning. This is going to look beautiful on pretty much everyone. It's a great everyday color. As you guys know, we moved in early January and when we were unpacking stuff, I didn't want to unpack everything because I know we're going to be moving again sometime later in the year. So I only unpacked my necessities. And with my jewelry, I probably only unpacked about a quarter of it. And I unpacked my Tiffany & Co jewelry, which I kind of have forgotten about, to be honest. And I thought, why have I not been wearing these? Ah, oh, I absolutely love them. So the two particular things I'm talking about are the Tiffany & Co heart tag earrings. I've been wearing these a lot in February and January. They're just silver hearts with please return to Tiffany & Co New York 925 written on them. And they're just silver, basic, cute. And then I've also been loving the matching heart tag bracelet which has the same heart on it with the same uh, writing and then it has two strands of chain either side of the little heart um, connecting it with a clasp and I think it's just so dainty and so cute. For clothes and shoes, I have been wearing this pair of shorts to death <laughs> and these are the Brie High Waisted uh, Shorts from Cotton On. That is what they look like. They're just a classic blue shade and they've got the two buttons there and they're very, very comfortable. Love them. They're so comfortable. They are rolled up uh, at, the, at the bottom but they're also sewed so that this doesn't roll down and I think that is the smartest idea in the world. I love wearing them with crop t-shirts as well as regular t-shirts and just tucking them in and they're just really comfortable. 
really love them. And they come in heaps of different colours, so I'll link it below if you want to check them out. And then the pair of shoes that I've been loving this month have... Ugh, covered in fudge hair. <laughs> and then the pair of shoes that I've been loving this month are from Kmart. And they're just these animal print uh, flats with this gold detailing on the front. And I just think they're really cute. I like wearing them when everything else that I'm wearing is just one colour and one basic, like no pattern. And then just a pop of uh, colour and pattern on my feet. And yeah, I really like them. I have been loving my diary that I got from Typo. Uh, so basically, it's just a 2015 diary. For each double fold out, it has your entire week. So, you know, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And so you can just see your week down on paper right in front of you. I just, I love writing out what I have to do down on paper in a diary so that I can actually physically see it and know what's coming up. I feel a lot less stressed when I do that. I don't know if you guys feel like that, but really love this diary. It's a good size. Uh, I think it's, oh, this might be uh, A5 or maybe A6. I can't remember what the size is, uh, but it has this elastic strap that goes around it to keep it closed. Uh, so it's great for your handbag, which I like to carry mine around with me wherever I go. That way I can just pencil things in uh, if I'm out and about. It also has a little bookmark thingy down here. And it's grey, but it's got silver glitter all over it. And I absolutely love it because it's so glittery and sparkly. And I love anything glittery and sparkly. So for my channel favourites for February, I have got two. Now my first one is called Makeup T.I.A. Uh, and her name is Ashley. So Ashley is a beauty, fashion and lifestyle channel and she has excellent natural product recommendations like with beauty products and like um, healthy food uh, that sort of thing. She also does awesome planning and organization videos which I love because I love my organization, I love my lists, I love my planners. I love that sort of thing. She does beautiful get ready's with me, which she talks through and then she shows you what she does after her get ready part. And I have to admit, I have been binge watching all of her videos. Not gonna lie, she has such a soothing and calming voice. So I just love watching her videos before I go to bed because it just calms me now. I don't know if that sounds weird, kind of sounds weird, but you know, some YouTubers just have a really calming and soothing voice and you just feel relaxed <laughs> after you watch one of their videos. And um, the way she films her videos and edits and it just flows so nicely and she deserves a lot more subscribers than she has. So I'll link her below so you can check her out. The second channel that I've been loving in February is called Refined Fashion and her name is Lauren. Now Lauren uh, does a lot of makeup tutorials. She used to be all about clothes and fashion, but now she's included makeup as well. She does do a bit of fashion, but uh, mostly makeup now. And oh my goodness, first of all, she looks like a Barbie doll. She is so gorgeous. And she does beautiful makeup tutorials, um, whether they are full on glam or a bit more natural and soft uh, for daytime or a date. She also uses a lot of MAC eyeshadows and as you guys know, I'm a big MAC eyeshadow fan. So I have a lot of the same eyeshadows as her, so it's interesting to see what she comes up with. And here's a little spoiler alert, we're going to be doing a video together sometime soon, so keep an eye out for that. So that is it guys, thank you for watching my video, I hope you had a really great month of February and I hope you have an awesome month of March as well. Also if you're new to my channel and you like my videos, don't forget to subscribe. I upload videos every four days and if you've subscribed to me then you don't have to go searching and it'll just pop up in your feed of videos. I'll talk to you soon in my next video. Bye! When I met you in the summer, till my heart beats out.